What's up guys, this is the Retro123. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to install Forge API for your Mac Minecraft. Um, this mod doesn't really affect your gameplay, although it does affect what kind of mods you can install. install. Um, so like more ex like explosive mods, you're going to probably need this mod half the time. Um, it's real simple, um, though I'm not going to lie, this mod has given me trouble because all the links that I've found when I've gone to download it and I've gone into the file or like into the mo uh, the, the mod it's missing it was missing a file the whole time and I screwed up my minecraft like four times until I found out that it needed a file that nobody had been given out but I found this really helpful video who had a very good link and the link had all the files necessary so today I'm going to give you that um, so let's go to bring over minecraft.jar also about this new file and this new link um, you're going to need to sign up for modgician it's free all the time. Um, you don't have to pay anything. Just quick, um, quick registration, and then you're in. And then you can download all sorts of mods from here, creatures, crafting, all sorts of great stuff. It's a just very nice um, website. So what we're gonna go to today is we're gonna go to um, gonna go to Core, and you're going to go to Download and Installation. Uh, for mod uh, Minecraft Forge, um, just go ahead and you can look through all this great stuff. And then um, here's the actual download installation page. Read these. Make sure you read these. These are very important. Um, and then here's down here. Um, these are for all the versions of Minecraft. Um, I'm doing 1.2.5 because that's what I have. Preferably that's what you would have to watch this video. But hey, this video probably works for all you guys. But Today I'm going to be showing you how to do it on 1.2.5. So let's go ahead and download it um, real quick, real easy, and we'll unzip it. Alrighty, let's go find it. Um, there it is. Okay, now that we have this unzipped, we can go through and I'm going to show you. All these were there, all these forge, this, all these class and forge class files. Don't worry about the text. This was the file that killed me every time. This is the file, the net file, that everybody, for some odd reason, was not including in their download. I don't know if they just felt like it was an evil day and they were going to destroy everybody's Minecraft, or they just forgot to include it, but this file was not in any of the ones that I downloaded. Um, so if your Forge does not have a net file, then you need to A, go download it again, or B, find a better site. But it needs the net file, file, or else you will not be able to install this mod. So, up until the net file, it's just the same. Um, you're going to drag and drop all this great stuff in there. The forge, even the file, not just the classes in it. You want to take the whole file and put it in there. So take all these class files. Um, don't worry about the text. Um, class files and that one folder in there. And when that's all in here, all these class files in the forge folder are in there. You're going to scroll down and you're going to find your net folder that should already be in your Minecraft. Um, you're going to go to Minecraft here and here. If there is not a client folder already in this Minecraft folder, you're just going to drag and drop the whole folder in there. But if another mod has already put a client folder in there, you're just going to open up the client folder and you're going to take the class files out of here and put them in that um, already pre-made uh, folder. So when that's done, um, everything should be finished. You should be ready, set, and um, go play Minecraft. Um, so let's go and start just to make sure. Um, and it works. There's no way to tell if it's working unless your Minecraft starts up. Then you know it's working. But this, like I said, does not affect your gameplay whatsoever. So that's about it. Before a uh, little recap here, um, make sure you have Mod Loader MP and Mod Loader installed. You need both of those installed for this to work. I have a video on um, the THX helicopter mod, and also in that same video is the Mod Loader MP installation process. So go watch that video if you do not have Mod Loader MP installed already. Um, make sure, make sure you do that, um, or else this mod won't work. Also, I've heard rumors that in order for this to work, you have to install Mod Loader, uh, Mod Loader MP, and um, uh, forge in that exact order I don't think that's true um, but if it is um, you guys go ahead and give it a test maybe make a duplicate of your jars and try it out um, but if that's true just leave me um, a comment and I will 
um, secure that. But if it's not true, then I'll just put those rumors to rest. Um, so I really appreciate you guys watching this video. I'm about to make a plus explosives mod in here about five minutes. So that should be really easy. And then you also need the forge for that mod. So um, I'm going to go do that now. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And also enjoy the plus explosives mod video I'm about to make. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.